guys, I would like to show you my little Honda B7000 IS. Right now, it's running my two-ton air conditioning unit of my house. Okay. Um, it's on eco throttle, but whenever I start the unit, I have to do full throttle and turn everything else off to get it to start the unit. This is the air condition that it's running right now. It won't do the big four ton unit, which is over there, but it will do this one, which I believe, I believe this is a two ton unit if I'm not mistaken, but it's running. And that one, I don't think I'm gonna try it. But anyway, we'll go back in the house and I'll show you how I did it. Um, and once you get it started, you can put it on eco throttle, and it's running only the air conditioner at 2,200 watts. Okay. Now, this is my main switch is off. My 20 amp is for my AC number two. That's my bedroom air conditioner. And then I pretty much kill everything else. And once I get it running, the air conditioner. I can flip everything else back on. Hear the, air can do, hear the generator speed up a little bit? Now that's with everything else. Now I do have LED lighting in my garage. This is with pretty much everything in the house on. Uh, 2600 watts. And I'll run back here right quick. I turn my thing on. Let me show you right quick my air conditioner. I am, it's getting nice and cold in there. Uh, but this is the big unit that's running off the generator now. I'm going to shut it off because it's really getting cold in here. I'm going to shut the fan back off. You always want to start it with the fan in the on mode. So that you get the head start and you don't have the surge of the fan also okay so back here we're back to the switch box uh, what we're doing is using we've got all these different power adapters for whatever we need I've even got a big Hubble 50 amp if I need it um, but this breaker here is the one that I flip when the main is off to back feed to the panel okay um, now this with air condition off, I'm only using 650 watts. So the air condition to start it, I have to put it in full, full run mode, not low idle. It also runs my five horsepower well pump, which is out there. And, uh, but I have to start the big unit with everything else off in the beginning and then I can put fans through the house, it'll cool the whole house, but I have to start that unit first and then add extra load. Anyway, that's how a Honda 7000 will run a two ton, I believe it's a two or two and a half ton, home air conditioning unit. And it runs it very efficiently, that's the way we do it during a storm. And uh, anyway, that's my video, I wanted to show with you what this little Honda can do. It's an awesome generator. I uh, only have uh, two hours on it right now, but it nicely runs the air conditioning. The overload light will come on for about two seconds, and once the unit starts, it'll go right back down to 2100 watts. And that's uh, sort of like a, one of these big air conditioning units like that. Anyway. That's it. That's how we run electric. So if we need to run the big unit, I can hook it into the big generator. But for right now, we're just using a small cord, small generator. But this gets us through all the storms. Anyway, I'm in love with my little Honda 7000. It's a fabulous generator. Would recommend it to anybody. Um, really nice unit. And when I have a storm, I just wheel it out. And it runs so nice and quiet and powers up my house. Anyway, you guys, you have a great day.